Hey guys, it is Xy here and today we are going to be playing Pop Goes the Dead Forest. This is Pop Goes Arcade 2020 edition, man. I have been waiting for this game for so long, but we are finally here. The game has come out and we get to play it. So let's go ahead and get into a new game, man. This is so exciting, bro. But uh, yeah, so uh, it seems like we are Pop Go. Wait, hold up. We're the weasel, okay. Um, and by the way, guys, make sure you go ahead and leave a like on this video if you want to go ahead and see this uh, become like a series type of thing where we do part one, part two until the very end. And I'm thinking we might get to the end on maybe either tomorrow or maybe Sunday as well because I heard this game is like three hours long. But uh, yeah, let's go ahead and get into it, man. So uh, this is where we spawned at. Let's go ahead and see. Okay, okay, so we have an inn right here. These are usually like shops or like save points in uh, these type of games. So let me go ahead and uh, just make my way over here. There's also a coin here as well. Let me actually turn this down a little bit as well because it's a little, just a little bit loud. Um, but yeah, it seems like we have an interaction right here. So uh, Sarah, Pop Goes, what, or what took you so long? We have a problem. Someone or something is draining the life of uh, the surrounding forest. We need to put a stop to it. The north forest has already fallen, so we need to prevent the effect from spreading to the others. Unfortunately, the north forest has been locked behind a gate that needs three keys. Maybe they are hidden in the west, south, and east forest. Yeah, that would definitely make sense, Sarah. Um, please take a look, venture through the west forest and see what you can find. Okay, so the west forest, alright, got you. Um, and it says, okay, yeah, that's just the objective right there. But can we actually just save real quick? Oh, this is like the menu, so it literally says our, uh, our objection, or whatever, like the thing that we have to do, yeah, objective. And then our progression, max X, X or HP, what am I saying, man? Attack, power, all of that, okay, that makes sense. Um, but can we actually save? That's really what I'm looking for. So, uh, Menorah. Hi, Pop Goes. Would you like to save your progress? Of course I would. Um, so, wait. Can I, like, move? It says save. Oh, okay, okay, yeah, yeah. I forgot you actually have to click. Okay. Nice. If you ever want, or if you ever get into trouble, um, I'll bring you each here. Man, I'll bring you back here with everything you, you have right now. Okay. I don't know why. It's just the font, really, for me right now. But, uh. Yeah, okay, so, uh, I guess we have to go to the west, which would be literally right here, right? This is what we have to do, and we cannot go for the flowers or anything, guys. Oh, plus 10, what is that? Is that, like, the currency in the game or something? I don't really know, but, uh, I guess we're just gonna find out. Man, you guys have no idea how hyped I am, man, I'm telling you. Please go ahead and leave a like on this video, because I really want to go ahead and make this into a series, man. Um, but wait, did we just end up... Yeah, we literally just ended up at, like, exactly where we were at before. So, uh, hold up. This seems to be, yeah, this is definitely the gate. This sign is for the North Forest, a.k.a. the Bluesome Forest, okay. Um, but it's been, uh, the 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 faced to say dead instead of Bluesome, okay. Uh, good jokes. Okay, hold up. So that's a silver coin, and that gives us ten instead of five. Um, this is a nice bird bath. I think stone uh, drinks out of it when it's full of uh, rainwater. Okay, very efficient. Um, so yeah, we definitely can't do anything here. I'm just trying to check literally everything out, guys. This gate has been locked by someone on the other side. It needs three keys, one red, one yellow, and one blue. Right, so uh, yeah, we're going to go ahead and go to the west now because we've definitely explored enough, all right? Um, so yeah, it seems like this... Thi Wait a minute, what? Do we have to, like, go down here? Oh, okay, okay, yeah, this is the west. Okay, that makes sense. I was, you know, trying to go, you know, through that way, but, uh, it's clearly this way. So, west forest, aka autumn forest. Alright, let's go ahead and get our coins. We definitely need those. Um, but yeah, let's go ahead and make our way down here, man. This is so exciting. I've been waiting for this game for so long. Okay, right. Corrupt Hedgehog. So this guy has 50 HP and I only have 30 as Pop Goes the Weasel. This is so tough. Okay, so we definitely have no items as you guys can see. We can block or we can attack and our attack is 4, his is 3. 
So yeah, let's go ahead and, you know, just try to beat him. It seems like it's doable so far. You know, uh, he definitely does less attack um, than we do, but uh, his health is uh, something that's going to, you know, make up for that. So we got to go ahead and just keep attacking, I guess. Um, so when is like a good time to, you know, block? That's really what I'm wondering. Um, because we can just keep attacking, but like, it seems like he's about to beat us. Like we have, oh God, this is actually bad. We might literally lose this right now. Yeah, we literally might lose this right now. Can we please, like, get a critical or something? Oh, no. Oh, no. I just died. <laughs> well, then. I lost. That was a great first fight then. Okay. Right. So, oh, my God. I have to start all over again. Right. Okay, then. I'm going to go and make my way back up there, guys. All right, guys. So, I'm back now. Um, I really don't know what, like, my strategy is or anything like that because... At the end of the day, guys, uh, that monster is probably going to get to me again. Yep, there we go. Um, oh, it's a different one now. It's Corrupt Hawk. Okay, so, uh, I mean, I'm going to just keep attacking, guys. It seems like he does a lot more health or a lot more damage than me. He has five and I have four. Um, but I don't really, like, I don't... Oh, oh, he just missed. Or she, I'm sorry. But, uh, yeah, let's just go ahead and keep attacking, I guess. Oh, okay. So, yeah, they can definitely miss, it seems like. So, that's a great sign moving forward. It seems like I just got really un... Oh, a critical. I was going to say, it seems like I just got really, you know, unlucky with the last one. But, yeah, it seems, like, pretty doable to kill them. Okay, so we got 15 coins for that. That's great. Right, so now we have 80 coins. That is absolutely wonderful. So, now, yeah, we can also get these as well. And is this a hole? Can we literally go through this hole? This hole seems to be a part of the tunnel system, but I'm not strong enough to dig through it. Okay, I like how, you know, Pop Ghost seems to actually talk and everything. Um, but yeah, let's me, let me go ahead and, you know, just make my way over here as well to the south. Ooh, we have another inn. So we can actually save over here, I'm guessing. Oh, oh God, please, please don't end me right here. Okay. Oh, this is, this is a pretty weak one. So we can go ahead and, you know, just take care of business real quick. Hopefully get our coins back up as well, you know, um, because I'm I'm pretty sure that that inn is actually a shop. And uh, the reason why I know that is because I actually watched the demo playthrough and there we go. So our critical is actually pretty powerful, man. Um, but yeah, I actually watched the demo of this game. So I probably know the first like 20 or so minutes of the game. Um, but yeah, let's go ahead and make our way to the inn now. Okay, so once again, back here. Hi, Menorah, or <laughs> hi, Pop Goes. Would you like to save your progress? I mean, of course, man. Why wouldn't I? Um, but the real thing to me is... Yeah, 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 I got it. I got it. The, the thing to me is like, can we buy things? Is that like possible? Can we do that up here in the doors or something? Um, yeah, they're not really interactive, so I guess not. I guess there's another shop at like some other point in this game so let's just go ahead and make our way oh oh i know you guys see that there's a little there's a little like oh god oh okay okay this is the this is the easy uh enemy right here guys corrupt beer or corrupt deer <laughs> i said beer um but yeah corrupt deer he seems to be like the easiest one to beat so that's absolutely great and it seems like my hp doesn't you know keep going down as i you know progress the through the game it kind of just you know goes back to 30 every time i fight so that's a great, great sign. Um, but yeah, I was just going to say there's a little uh, a little thing right here that we can, you know, walk through. Let me go ahead and go through it. Okay, so there's also this right here. Can we interact with it? Doesn't seem like it. Let me go on and get this coin over here. Man, I really, I really don't want to lose this progress. Oh yeah, then again, we did just save, so it doesn't really matter. Um, let me make my way down here and get these. But uh, I definitely want to go in and check this out real quick. Oh! We have a shop. There we go, guys. So uh, this right here is where I can actually... And no, we can't interact with this. Um, but yeah, this right here is where I can actually, you know, buy some things and upgrade. Um, yeah, Blake. Hi, Pop Goes. You buying something? Definitely, man. Definitely. So that's the crow. Oh, red. Never mind. Um, hi there, Pop Goes. Would you like... Or yeah, what would you like... What would you like to buy today? Jeez, what am I? What is wrong with me today with reading, man? Um, but yeah, so acorns will give you back 25% of your total HP. Honestly, man, I'm really looking for the things where like I get permanent uh, health boosts or permanent, you know, attack boosts like this right here. I don't really want the you know plus 25% stuff like that. 
This also gives you full HP. And what is this? The shield is a magical spell that will give you total invinci invincibility for the, r for the next three turns. Okay, so that's really, really good. Um, but yeah, I'm really just looking for things like this where I can actually, you know, physically get better for the rest of the playthrough. Um, me personally, I'm definitely going to get my attack up because that seems like something that I need a lot of. And I'm also going to upgrade my HP as well. So I think, yeah, we have nothing now. Um, so that's it right there. Nice doing business with you. Yep, you too, Red. Um, so yeah, I mean, that's, that's good right there. Let me go ahead and make my way to the other side now. Oh, another enemy. Let's go on and see. Ooh, Corrupt Hedgehog. This is the guy that we first encountered, but now we should be able to actually beat him. Yo, we literally have 8 attack and 40 HP, so there's like basically no way that we can actually- Oh god! Oh god, yeah, I'm pretty sure this means that I actually have to block at this turn because him flashing means that he's about to do like his uh, special attack. And he actually did a critical, but it only did 5 damage. Man, that is very sad, honestly. Um, but yeah, let me go ahead and, you know, keep attacking you because you're pretty easy to beat at this point, man. And um, I'm pretty excited to see what I get for actually beating you as well because you are a pretty tough opponent. But yeah, let me go ahead and just, you know, keep destroying you, buddy. Um, I don't know if this is like the most powerful uh, person or monster in this, you know, uh, area, the west area. But uh, hopefully it is because I do not want to encounter anything more powerful than that. But uh Thankfully, um, we did beat him. Anyways, let me go in and make my way over here. Okay, so we have this silver coin. I love the silver ones, man. Can I just keep getting the silver ones instead of these, you know, uh, not very good ones? Um, this is a rock. Okay, I think he, I think there's something behind this boulder, but I have no idea how to get through it. Okay, so probably we'll get like a special move or something, and then we'll eventually be able to uh, go back there. So definitely got to go ahead and keep that in mind for sure um but yeah let me go ahead and make my way back up over here and then we can finally progress through this part of the map right um yeah okay so we have this this uh saffron okay i remember you uh hey i heard i heard uh what does that say about your little quest okay i tried looking for a key myself and i doubt there's one in this forest but feel free to keep looking okay yeah that makes sense what is this it's a cage with fruit inside. This sign says that it's been set up to catch corrupt animals in this part of the forest. Okay, that's kind of sad, honestly. They're like hunting down the... I guess, you know, they kind of deserve it, I guess. But uh, that is a little bit sad. Um, okay, just before I could get my coin. Thank you very much, corrupt hawk. Uh, but yeah, this, this guy is just simple, man. You have less health and less attack, attack power. Uh, than me so yeah you're just you're an easy one at this point you know you were kind of hard at the very beginning but yeah at this point man i have no worries about you all right um 15 man i really wish you got more you know for uh for getting rid of the monsters i wonder if these uh coins like refresh as well oh is this a zip line okay let me go to check this out oh come on now okay we got another one of these these this is this is the easiest one to beat, all right? He is, like, literally only three, um, you know, possessions away from dying. Like, that is so easy. But, uh, yeah, I really just want to go in and check out this zip line real quick. So, what is this? There's something... <clears throat> wow. There's something on the other end of this zip line, but I can't find a way uh, to use it. Okay. Um, I mean, I guess we'll, you know, eventually be able to do that as well. Is this just another rock? Okay. Uh, what is this right here? This sign warns of danger ahead, but it has been vandalized with red paint. I can make out um, A, C, and N, R? What? R, C, and N, R? I don't really know what that said. Um, but I definitely want to get those coins, that's for sure. Ooh, that's a critical. It does 24 damage? Okay, I like that. I really like that uh, for sure. But uh, yeah, hold up. So... Um, yeah, we got this. We have 120. Man, I really do not want to lose progress right now. That is for sure. Yeah, you're easy, man. Go ahead and just take your beating, man, because you have no chance against, against uh, Pop Goes. You really have, like, literally nothing on us. And we did a critical damage with uh, 24, and he only had 4 left. That is tough, man. Um, but yeah, I'm really just scared to see, like, what's on the other side of this. 
what in the world okay what can i interact with these walls i i don't think i can um corrupt hawk man you are easy just go away just go ahead and give me my hp already because you're clearly not going to beat me all right um yeah come on now come on come on now let me go ahead and just get this uh done with but uh to be honest with you what i'm actually gonna do just in case you know this is actually a tough fight I'm actually gonna go all the way back and save my game. Also go to the shop as well because I do wanna go ahead and check that out um, just to make sure that I get, you know, my bag uh, filled up and everything. Well, not filled up, but you, you know what I mean. Like, go ahead and just get some new things so I can, you know, have more attack, more HP, and maybe even an item or two. All right, guys, so we're back at the shop. We have 175 coins to spend. Um, why did I say spam like that? But, uh, yeah, hi there, Pop goes, yup, 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 okay, right. So, this is the very, very important part because that is clearly the, the, like, mini boss or whatever of this level. Um, you could just tell because it was literally, like, a thing on the floor and everything. And I did see the demo as well, so I know for a fact that that is a, uh, a mini boss. Um, but yeah, I really just want to go in and get my attack up to be completely honest with you. So, I got one of those... I wonder if I should get one of these as well. So pizza does get you to full HP, which is very interesting to say the least. You know, I would do this and then I would also do, you know, uh, the HP one as well. And then I think that might honestly be pretty good, right? Is that is that a good idea? This food, yeah, the best food item of them all. Eat this and it'll restore your health to full. So yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna go to get one HP just so to just to make sure that we have 50. And then I'm also gonna get, you know, this pizza right here as well. So now we should be good. Let me go ahead and you know go back to our little spot over there. Well, first of all, I definitely have to save. That is something that I should definitely not forget to do, guys. So uh yeah, I'm going to go in and just save my progress real quick, and then uh, we can finally make our way back to the mini boss and uh, complete this first part of the video. And if you, ha if you have enjoyed and you've made it up to this part already, then please go ahead and leave a like on this video, man. As long as you guys keep doing that, I'm going to go ahead and keep this, you know, making this a series and possibly do part two tonight. I'm not sure if that will actually happen, but uh, maybe. Definitely a maybe. Let's go ahead and do this, man. Oh my god, are you serious? Oh, okay, Is this this is the mini boss then, okay. Corrupt Chica, you're clearly lost if you've wondered uh, here. Pest, okay, you just call me a pest, that is tough. Stay away and you won't get hurt, okay. I'm definitely not gonna stay away. Now you do have 60 HP and 6 attack, so I'm not really too worried about you to be completely honest with you. I'm just gonna go ahead and just, you know, go for my attacks, and you already missed, so you're clearly not confident enough to beat me, Corrupt Chica, so yeah, go ahead and just give up already, man. 6-6-6, six, six, six. okay, let me go ahead and just keep attacking you, yeah, you're, you are done for, I was definitely, oh god, he, or she just jumped, are you serious? They can just jump like that and, you know, um, skip my attacks, that's kind of weird, but, uh, yeah, you're definitely done for, man, oh my god, don't do this to me. If you jump again, I swear. Okay, there we go. So we beat Corrupt Chica. Man, I kind of feel bad. I wonder if you can, like, not beat them and somehow still win, like, a pacifist playthrough or something. Um, but probably not, though. I feel like you just die. But anyways, I did get 50. I wish I got more for literally beating the mini boss. That's kind of tough. You know, I literally just beat a mini boss and you only gave me that. But there we go. We did get our first key. That is absolutely great. It says, speak to Sarah in the Garden Inn. Okay. Okay. Let me go and go up here first. What is this? Is this like a mini, like a shortcut back or something? Okay, hold up. This area is for Chica only. For she is the only one who can jump over this hole. Oh man, I have, I have almost a, I'm, I'm very, very certain that we're going to be able to do this like eventually in the game. And I'm going to have to remember to go back here to do it. Um, but yeah, I can see something on the other side of this hole, but there's no way I can jump over it. Yep, yep, I get it, I get it. We'll probably get those abilities later on in the game. But for right now, let me go ahead and just make my way back up. And uh, yeah, we will be done with this episode once I, you know, talk with Sarah.